Hello again everyone, and welcome to Time Traveler's Coin Exchange. The next coin that we're going to take a look at here is a 1971D Kennedy half dollar. Uh, this one is a business strike coin from the Denver Mint. It has been graded by PCGS, and they graded it MS66. Um, now, I don't normally do half dollars. Um, I pretty much have zero experience with them. Uh, so this is um, maybe the fourth or fifth half dollar I've looked at graded by PCGS. Um, I think I collected them when I was like eight years old. Um, and I've picked up a couple of them when I bought collections of others. Uh, but, you know, I'm a small cent, large cent guy. Um, you know, I dabble in a couple other things, some two cents, three cents, 20 cents, colonial. Um, but, you know, half dollars have not been my thing. So I just decided to buy some half dollars, um, you know, check out some different coins. Um, I've tried to get into quarters before. I almost collected the entire state quarter set, um, both uh, proof and uh, business strike, uh, both the clad and silver, and then somebody bought my collection before I could finish it. And I've just never gotten back in. So uh, I really don't know a lot about these. Um, I am noticing that my uh, camera and light setup make these come uh, you know, not really half dollar color here. Um, so I might have to do some uh, changes to things so that they look kind of more uh, silvery metal color, um, you know, that they should, um, because I don't really feel like we're getting the true color here. I feel like something's reflecting off of it. Um, yeah, I feel like I can see quite a lot of colors. Uh, copper seems to work really good for my setup. Um, so I'm going to have to do some adjustments if I do more half dollars in the future. Uh, but I do notice uh, here on YouTube and in the coin collecting community, a lot of people are into half dollars. So I thought I'd flirt with it a little bit. Um, you know, buy some, you know, worst case scenario, they'll sit in my store and I'll have a couple uh, half dollars for sale. Um, so I'm going to try to get some older ones. I did get a couple um, ones uh, from the 50s, I think. Uh, last weekend, and uh, maybe I'll show you guys those tomorrow if I open up the packages. Um, I have a ton of coins coming in. Uh, I did start another giveaway today, so there are now three uh, cash PayPal giveaways. Uh, this one's a $10 instead of a $5, um, and I also uh, made more ways uh, to enter to win. Um, so if you guys haven't checked those out, Oh, speaking of, I'm going to need to add it. I didn't add it to, or I'll do that right now uh, after I post this video. Um, but they're at the bottom of the video in the, or under the video in the description, at the very bottom of the description, that uh, there'll be the three giveaways. Um, you just uh, need to visit the Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook, uh, and it'll give you entries to it. They're just trying to, a way to say thank you guys for the support. Uh, and I'm using Gleam.io because uh, then I have no part on choosing who the winner is. Um, so you guys will know that it's fair and I'm not just giving it to a friend or family or myself. <laughs> um, but if you guys enjoy the videos, feel free to hit the like and subscribe and share button. Uh, I will have a scheduled stream on uh, tomorrow, Saturday, July 11th at 9 p.m. So I hope to see you guys there. Um, it'll either be a coin vault has opened episode or we'll uh, search through a roll of mint cellos um, coins cut from a mint set um, So thanks everyone for watching wish you guys a beautiful night I'll probably have a couple more coins here tonight, and I'll see you guys in the future